Hi, I'm Kevin Brudris from Conservation Law Foundation. Thank you so much, all of you, for being here today. I just want to let you know that Conservation Law Foundation is here standing with everyone in this community trying to fight this proposed garbage depot on Allen's half. Uh, I'm going to echo something that Pedro mentioned earlier, that they're talking about bringing 2,500 tons a day of garbage into this facility. That's, that's about two-thirds as that's about two-thirds the amount of garbage that goes to the central landfill serving all of Rhode Island every single day. <laughs> Running through this community that suffers from the highest asthma rates in the state and has long, has long been forced to bear the environmental burdens of everyone else. Uh, this facility, in addition uh, to being two-thirds the size in terms of waste of the central landfill in Johnston, uh, would be larger than every single other transfer station in Rhode Island, than every single transfer station in Rhode Island and Massachusetts. So we're talking about the largest transfer station in the region being located on an extremely small parcel right in South Providence. That doesn't make any sense. Particularly, particularly when we talk about um, the dust that's going to come from this facility, the odors that are going to come from this facility, and the plan that this facility has to spray leachate, basically garbage juice, into the air to fight dust. None of this makes any sense for this community. The Conservation Law Foundation is here with you all and will be here with you all in March to oppose the siting of this facility in this location. Thank you.